back to Casper Rose Vlogs. Um, we are camping with the church. So, that's There's nice. not enough room up here for you. Mm -mm. Hello, darkness, my old friend. I stole it up way too fast I can. <laughs> Just thought I know, yeah. <laughs> anyway, so we are camping. In a cabin. So we're glamping. I got a top bunk. I got a top bunk. Anyway, so I'm going to see about vlogging this. If you're seeing this, it means I remembered. If not, this will probably be deleted. Goodbye. We'll see. Bye bye. See you guys later, maybe. Or never. I forgot to post this week, so, you know, could be never. Or if we die. You know, if we die in the woods, it'd be never too. We need to keep our eye out for the police. Um, because. Not because of that. I think they're gonna come arrest Noah soon. Yeah, because she's hungry. Totally. I think the fashion police are gonna come for. Oh no. Rainbow. It does a rainbow thing. Anyways. Tis June. <laughs> picture. That's rude. Your hair. Move that lovely picture. I wanted to get a picture of my hair, but it's being a little bit. Well, I can just. Um, you're so good as you can. Video, look at that. <laughs> oh. Whoa. <laughs> For to die. In French. <laughs> as I aggressively kick my cane. Uh huh. Yeah. But. Oh. Mm. All right, let's go drag the bodies to fire. Oh, Come on. <laughs> well. We'll burn the body to what it'll do. Does someone want to tell me why? My immediate response to seeing that is I can be an axe murderer. Are you with the large? Yeah. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I just got a burst of it. Energy out of nowhere. Uh huh. Yep. <laughs> Stay in frame. <brain. laughs> huh? No. Come back down. No. Poke. Mm. Poke. <laughs> Rude. I'm gonna put round up. I, I live in, in Amazon. Lion. Can you get that one? Oh. Great, this is my POV now. Gorgeous. Top tier. She's a lion. <laughs> That's a snake. Not a lion. <laughs> Funny, I brought my Hufflepuff one. Oh yeah, get it ready. Next one. You definitely got an amount of sleep. Yep. What an amount of sleep. We had the obstacle course today and X dog. So. Yep. Specifically, we're doing um, uh, um, zip line of race. Well, that's the obstacle course. Oh, is it the. I think she. Didn't she change it to zip lining? No, that's part of the obstacle course. Oh, okay. I don't know anymore. Ignore me. I know because I did it last year on my birthday. Is that when you broke down? No, okay. I broke down before and after that. Mainly because information that I'm not putting on YouTube. Fair. Sorry, guys. I'm but, uh, just cool to get that information. It's a little bit too personal. Yeah. So you've got a bruise knee. I've got a trying not to dislocate me. My body is in so much pain right now. I... 
want to go home and get in a hot tub and hopefully have this not be in so much pain. We're gonna be screwed at girls camp, aren't we? Probably. <laughs> also, my eyebrows look so light. Okay, I'm joking. It looks like the side character, like the side character in some movie, he's gone from the nerd, he's going into his jock phase. But like he had to get that weird awkward middle ground where it's like you're the convenience store clerk. Do you see it? <laughs> and I'm also wearing a tank top underneath. Yes, definitely a convenience store clerk. <laughs> You're so mean. You love me. Depends. Anyway, so I will try and update you guys later at the obstacle course and how bad Noah is at axe throwing. I'm not bad at axe throwing. See you later. later. What is it? I want to throw the world out a window. So we're watching Mulan instead. Yep. <laughs> And an eventful morning. Yep. It's 11 and one of the kids just had a seizure. It was not either of us, I promise. <laughs> and we were the one with the medical stuff. No. And specifically like, m m like worrisome medical stuff. I would have gone over and given the information that I know about some seizure stuff. But A, I don't know that much. B, I feel like trash and we're just coming walking around to see Oh, to oh. get out of the um, cabin for a minute. And see, I refuse to research Caesar stuff right now for personal reasons. <laughs> anyway, so we just get away from camp for a minute. Anyway, fun eventful morning. So they took the kid away in an ambulance. <laughs> down to the <coughs> hospital and I'm just sitting here like I know this is bad but I'm glad it wasn't either of us I'm definitely not glad that it was anyone yeah but either way glad it's still it wasn't us yeah still definitely scary especially if it's like your first medical episode like I remember oh my gosh my first time I passed out oh I woke up so disoriented and I like could still hear things around me but I was like, what in the world? Uh, like, the first time I passed out was actually a different time. But, like, the first time I started with the consistent passing out on tracks, <laughs> it was great. Because I was just sitting there like, don't pass out, don't pass out. Because I had made a remark, I'm like, I might pass out. Like, half joking. And then they had me sit down there, like, because someone got off the train. I was like, And Noah down. and Emo were like, sit. And sit I was down. like, okay, fine. I'm not actually going to pass out, though. It's fine. And then I'm sitting there like, pass don't out. pass out, don't pass out, fridge. Went down so hard, and I we don't even know how long I was out. Mm -mm. All I know is I came back to Noah is sitting there like, oh my gosh. <laughs> and a lot of people are not on the train anymore. Yep. So that's nice. That happened almost a year ago. Yeah. That's crazy. And then a bit later on, I started passing out. It was the first night of Fanex, huh? Mm-hmm. And then a bit later on, I started passing out. And look at us, not even a full year later, and we've got some diagnoses. Yep. Except we have no idea why I'm passing out. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> no, 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 no idea at all. Yeah. Um, I would like for them to do, like, a test for POTS, but they won't. Um, they supposedly did one, but they did it incorrectly, so we didn't get the results that would have diagnosed me with it. So I don't know for sure that I don't have it, but we don't know for sure that I do. So they're actually looking into getting another neurologist on my team to see if it's seizures. Passed out the other day, though, like, um, because like I said, I had thrown up a few days ago, mm -hmm. and I passed out then. And my dad goes, well, I don't think this is a seizure. I'm like, wow, really? Whoa. So. Shocker. You know, I could say that, like, some of it's seizures, because you could claim my spacing out is absent seizures, but I don't know for sure. 
and I refuse to research it because when I attend to research things, I'm either the person who has it or I know someone who has it. Yep. How's that going for you? Well, it should tell you something because I know a lot about fibro. <laughs> either way, I stole his nausea medication. Yeah. I have more than enough, so. I stole one. Hopefully it helps. I think it is at this point. Because I'm not good. as nauseous as this morning. That's good. We're having great, great time. I've already also had to take a nauseous pill, which is I mean, lovely. The, the good side of this is neither of us are the ones in the hospital. The bad True. side of this is one of my friends is in the hospital. Yeah. So, hopefully they're okay, though. Don't know exactly what happened. Great morning. Mm-hmm. And it's not even 12. But now we're talking, we're like, okay. Because <laughs> what they did is when the kid passed out and started seizing, they crowded him. <sighs> and crowding whoever has a seizure or a pass out is it's not, not a great a idea. idea. And because both of us pass out, we're like, okay, one of us is bound to, one of us is bound to pass out at some point during, during this, this weekend. Or both of us, for that matter. We don't know because we're... Knowing us. We're doing great. Like, um, I mean, I haven't passed out a lot recently other than, uh, I think... I passed out a couple of days ago, but I don't... Wait, no, Same. I passed out yesterday at work. Mm, um, I think I did too. I'm not entirely sure. Anyway, but because of that, we're like... Especially for me, if people start crowding me when I'm coming back too, because it takes me about three minutes to kind of realize what happened, even if I was in pre-syncope. Well... Typically, when I'm in free syncope, I'm a little bit faster to come back to what's reality. Yeah. But um, let's not even have... at that. It's like disorienting because you're like, "Oh crap, that just happened again." Especially when you pass out, though. Mm -hmm. Like when you pass out or start seizing, because then it is so scary. Especially if you've never had that happen. Yeah. So um, having a whole bunch of people crowd you is not fun. Mm -mm. So either way, we've decided if one of us passes out, body bodyguard bodyguard because for us at least it's normal they know that it happens so hopefully they don't just freak out like they did for this kid who it's not normal for which they shouldn't that one makes sense though because mm -hmm. they don't have a history of seizures mm -hmm. you know it's scary i hate when medical stuff happens yeah and we can't do a lot because it's we we can't just tell people to do things because mm -hmm. we're not in charge that we're pretty <laughs> like i said seizures are one of the things at the moment i'm refusing to sit and study um because i've studied a lot of things like before i got my eds diagnosis i did study that quite a bit i've definitely studied pots a lot mm -hmm. um along with a few other different conditions but seizures are one that I'm kind of just refusing to teach myself about right now. So I don't know too much about it. We also were supposed to do the obstacle course this morning, but of course I wasn't feeling good. And we actually got put in the group that goes later in the day. So so we kept with it. Yeah. So we're going to do axe we throwing and the obstacle course. Because we could have chosen to do one of them. Mm-hmm. Until then, we're just going to chill, chill and watch Mulan. <laughs> Maybe I'll drag you to watch some Marvel. <laughs> so, there's our fun little update. Glad I mean, it wasn't us. Yeah, glad. But really not good that it happened either. Yeah. Jeez, that sounds about as stupid as me. <laughs> mm-hmm. You should be glad I'm forcing you to eat right now. Even if you are nauseous. Yeah, I don't know that forcing you to eat was the best idea either. I, okay. So I you thought breakfast was going to be earlier. Yeah. And so I took my medication like a full hour before I ate. And I'm supposed to eat with my medication. I normally don't do that. It's normally fine. But I did that today. Also, brain frog. <laughs> I don't call it brain fog anymore. It's the brain frog. Brain frog. I like frogs. And this frog steals my brain. Frog brain. So, I'll try and record some of the axe throwing and 
um, the obstacle course if I can. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to bring my phone. Actually, oh, they I have haven't. to let me bring my phone. I haven't been recording. <laughs> they might have to let me bring my phone because medical. Yeah. Um. Anyway, I'll see if I can record some of that for you guys. If not, just know we had fun and I'm probably terrible at axe throwing. I have done axe throwing before, so I had oh, about if we were doing three archery, to four, three to four times. If it was archery, I'd be slaying the game. Okay, I am good at We archery. were going to do rock climbing, but she had changed it, so we were doing the obstacle course, which I'm not mad about because no, I have never mad. been uh, on a zip line. At least a really long zip line. Yeah, and this zip line's really, really fun. You can, like, if it's the same one as last year, you can reach out and, like, you could grab flowers as you went past. Ooh. It was so cool. I'm excited. Because uh, last year, I did technically go on a zip line, but it was a really short one that you, it was from, like, one tree to another. And I was like, it wasn't the funnest, but it was a zip line. I mean, it's definitely not, like, a super duper long one, but it's a longer one. Yeah. Like, it's one of the longer ones I've done. So, yeah. 12 minute update. Great morning. Yep. I also brought my sunglasses, so that's nice. <laughs> I uh, really should have brought my contacts, but oh well. See you guys later. Bye bye. We're off to see you. Wizard. <laughs> Wonderful Wizard of Oz. <laughs> I didn't record us axe throwing because we were going at the same time. Yeah. Okay, I might not be able to record actually on the zipline. Yeah. It's fine. We're done. That might be a little tight. That's the zipline, so you have to go across there and then down there. It's really short and small, but you know. Fun! Great. <laughs> the adrenaline rush that I just got. <laughs> it was really fun. But just a short little zip line. I was actually the only one to do it without hands. Let's go, I did the little log part without hands. But... Go in, jump up. So yeah, you have fun? Ah. I should probably pause the music. <laughs> That then. Oops. Ah. Well, You're... I might just put my own music over this. Fair. I'll make subtitles for what we're saying. Ah. <laughs> I would like for you to not be copyrighted. I'm gonna make subtitles so I'm gonna have my music playing and just make subtitles of what we're saying. Well, I paused my music. I'll so... just say that it was a copyright problem. They'll never know. We could be saying anything and they'd have no idea. Did you know the accuracy of reading lips is only 30%? Mm hmm That's interesting. Yep. Very. Mm-hmm. Ah, the bruise on my knee is horrific. Ah! <laughs> oh, sorry, there's plenty of Somebody gave me fire! <laughs> Christina. 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 Fire. I have no idea if this is actually getting us in here or not. Uh, Hopefully. Christina, is there any more graham crackers left or is that it? Not lost. They just don't know where we're going. Both on the left. On the left. We're not lost. They just don't know where we're going. Did you figure out the map we're using now? We're doing great. I don't have my whistle on me. That's annoying. I have an extremely loud. I have that one. <laughs> my whistle is, in fact, either on one of my backpacks or in my first aid kit. I love that. Oh, oh, that's amazing. Challenge course. Two. 
There's more signs up there. What does that sign say, Carrie? I don't think we're going to this. No, I don't think we are either. Looks like they're building another cabin. We're not lost. Good thing we're wearing water shoes. So, now I ended up catching a ride back, and I'm still hiking up this trail. Got a couple of other people behind us, but, you know, it's been great. It's really pretty, it's just really hot. Great. What's this? Well, we made it back. Nope, can't can't see Noah. Um, no one died. <laughs> but we made it back to the cabin. It's about lunch time, so we'll probably head out and get lunch in a minute. But until then, we're chilling here. Yay! How are you doing down there? We're just finishing. Oh, We're getting ready to leave camp. How do you feel? Ah. Are you enjoying your sodium? I'm numb. Yeah. Get ready to head out. I killed my foot, so this toe <laughs> is like completely cut it's up. It's at 58. BS. Absolute BS. There's no way. My I'm still over 100. So, there's no way that you drop lower than that. Yeah, no. No, the fact that I'm still above 100, there's no way you're under 100. Unless the world just decided to collapse. Which I mean is possible. <laughs> anyway, say bye to camp.